Hi guys, good morning. Today is Saturday. Today is the day that I'm gonna do four parks in one day. And um, I'm not gonna do it alone, of course, but I'm gonna be doing it with my friend. Morning. So, hi! As I was saying, I am going to be doing the four parks today, and my girlfriend is actually meeting me there with her daughter. So, that's going to be a fun girl's day. We're excited. And, um, what another thing that's really cool is that she does not mind at all to be on film. So, she's fun. So, that's going to be fun and interesting. So, uh,. And now I have um, breakfast at Be Our Guest, and I'm leaving my resort and heading over to Magic Kingdom. It looks like they're watering. Uh, watering all their beautiful plants. Ooh, I'm gonna get wet. Awesome. There was a small tidbit of information that I forgot to give you guys the other day. And um, as I was driving around different resorts or whatever, I passed a pet boarding place here on Disney property. So if you guys bring your pets, you know, your alligators, snakes, rats, whatever you guys have, um, you guys can drop them off at the little boarding place and leave your pets there. Um, I'm assuming it's for dogs and cats, but I don't know, somebody might bring their pig and they might need to leave it somewhere. So. I just thought you guys should know that. Interesting tidbit of information. There's a car in front of me from Hampshire, Illinois. Yes, indeed. I know exactly where Hampshire High School is. My twin boys are going to be seniors there this year. Interesting, isn't it? Um, so I always like to, like, if I see them and I'm like, oh, I see you getting, I don't know if I see them getting out of their car or whatever, I usually like, oh, so what part of uh, Illinois are you from? Even though I know it says Hampshire, I will be like, oh, yes, my twin boys actually go to Hampshire High School. Yeah, very interesting. Oh, my God, why is our traffic backed up? What is this? What is this? So, I need a, f oh, I think I went the wrong way. Oh, crap. Damn it. How do I do this all the time? Disney's Epcot. Oh, no, Magic Kingdom. Yay, I did it right. I knew it was going the right way. Magic Kingdom next right. Woohoo! So anyway, as you guys see my hair as it is right now, it's a little on the, looks a little fry or frizzy. Number one, let's blame that on the humidity. Um, but the way that you see my hair right here right now is probably not the way it's going to be in about two hours. Um, the humidity is like, way up there um, although right now it's only 71 degrees um, the humidity is just like whew, off the charts crazy all right mr. Hampshire move it or mrs. Hampshire because I see she's driving she's got big old ears on which speaking of ears I need to actually try to wear mine today I'm gonna try to wear my new ones although those are heavy but I'm gonna try to wear them the thing is that it's so my other ones are kind of hot even though they're small but they're right on top of my head um but the other thing is uh is that they hurt when i wear my sunglasses and these little littler ones that i have um they don't hurt as bad they are s smaller or thinner you know as you behind your ears so anyway so like I've said before, um, I'm headed to Magic Kingdom this morning, and I'm headed to my breakfast at Be Our Guest, which I'm so excited. I'm gonna have breakfast with the Beast. Wouldn't that be so cool if the Beast actually like came out? That'd be so cool. Um, but anywho, uh, if you guys are ready to stick around with me all day long and jump to park to park with me, or hop to park to park, I guess that's what you can say, then stick around and um, hang out with me and keep watching. If not, then this is where you can say adios, Angie. Um, but I'm excited, so let's get this day started, shall we? Yay! 
Um, just another little tidbit of information. Um, if you guys are not a resort guest, you do not get this little pass that I have in my window. Um, so if you stay at a Disney Resort on property, you get to park for free and parking is $17 per park per day. So if you go to Magic Kingdom for the morning and then you go to Animal Kingdom for the afternoon, chances are you're going to be paying $17 um, each for both parks. So um, anywho, uh, just so you guys just so you guys knew that. And uh, here's welcome to Magic Kingdom guys. Look at my sticker dude or look at my past dude. Thank you. And uh, just so you, I just thought you guys should know that because it just makes it a little bit more easier if you guys stay at a resort because then you don't have to pay for parking and it's $17 so that'll save you $17. So that's a perk of staying at one of the resorts uh, which I found to be um, a little uh, better honestly but here we are getting ready to go park at Disney Magic Kingdom and I kind of want to just give you guys like you know experience the whole thing with me a couple weeks ago um this is the um uh, petty i can't think of his name but anyway i always want to say tom petty but i know it's not tom petty <laughs> so uh anyway that's the something petty experience right there but they closed they're closing it or supposed to close it and um so oh okay see so we're going to be parking in the heroes lot Anyway, um, somebody died there. One of the instructors died there um, about a month or so ago. How sad is that? But uh, Richard Petty, that's what it is. Richard Petty experience. So um, yeah, it's a, actually it's a expensive too to do. Um, but yeah, they're supposed to be closing it down. So that's just another little tidbit of information for y'all. If you guys are familiar with the parking here at Disney, it's like um, a mile in to the park itself so you park your car and you get on a tram and then you go to the ticket um, and information desk where you pick up the monorail or the boat to go across and I always choose the monorail as long as it's running but anyway so it looks like oh my goodness look at the this park is already getting full I know this lot is like empty but way up here and I bet you there's not gonna be a tram because we're parking so close to the entrance yeah no tram here because we're parking so close to the entrance hi guys uh, and they wave good morning oh she's not waving she's waving me in I thought she was waving to be nice hee <laughs> hee so I'm actually going to bring my ears and I'm going to put them on. Um, yeah, there's not going to be a tram. So let me get parked and get out and I'll get back with you guys later. Made it for the morning show. Which I honestly thought that I'd be here before. Uh,
then I did put my ears on. See behind me? Lots of people. I can't see behind me, so I don't know. I'm assuming there's a ton of people. Well, I got here for the morning show, so that was a bonus. They wouldn't let me in early because my reservation isn't until. Am I going straight or am I turning? I don't know. It's 40. Find out. We should ask someone. Let's. Where? Follow them for the oh, train. Breakfast. <laughs> oh my god, the line for the mine train is already like really long, so I think I'm skipping that. I'm just gonna go straight over here to breakfast. <sighs> the pretty rose. Mm. Look at the rose. bit of information. There are no single rider lines at Magic Kingdom. So, fail. So I think I'm going to go ahead and go do the um, the teacups. Yeah, I'm going to go do the teacups all by myself. And then I might go ride Dumbo all by myself. There we go. So, let's go check out the line for teacups. y mantenga sus manos, brazos, pies y piernas dentro de la taza. Y por favor, cuide a su pelo. There I go. Chao. Should I spin it? Oh my God, it's so hard to spin. Okay, so dizzy, so dizzy. Okay, that's enough spinning. So I'm going to head over to Dumbo and my friend is running late so uh, which is no big deal because I'm not in a big hurry really I'm, I am supposed to do four parks today but uh, whatever so I'm going to go to Dumbo because I can. Oh I got to watch my time too because I forgot I do have mine train. No, I have Peter Pan's flight at, let's see, what time is Peter Pan's flight? I don't know. Let's go get on Dumbo, guys. Then I'm going to have to like, get into my... Hello! Morning! 
Okay, I'm gonna have to log in to my fast. This thing, I never ever have to log in at home, and I get to the park and now I have to like log in. So, must log in. I got the coveted red red card to say how long it takes the line. You're very, very privileged when you get this card, honestly. Good morning. Thank you. So I've never rode this little ride before. The Barnstormer. Never rode it, so this will be my first time riding it. Um, just never found an interest in it. It's like a kid ride, a kid roller coaster, but I thought I'd give it a try because it's fun. So, yay! You guys get to ride it for the first time with me. Speed towards the checkered flag in your very own race. 
nice time. Young or old, this is your chance to drive to the fast lane. I'm not worrying about hitting a speeding ticket. Jennifer, they live in Orlando. Actually, they used to live in Chicago. Um, our husbands used to RC race together. That's that's how we met, like for the first time, what, last October? Yep. Yeah, it was in October. At Disney. Yes, at Disney. You know, I just saw Stitch walking through when I was on the people mover earlier. I don't like that ride, though, or the Stitch oh my thing. <laughs> We've been on it twice. I can't believe that they don't have any other. I like that shirt. Maybe you'll find some at Epcot. Maybe I'll find Star Wars. Yeah. First things. Awesome. Um, but if the, that stage is not up and like big like that, right? Um, Say the see right Chinese here, theater. theater. Yeah. Which is really a beautiful view. Yes. Well, we saw half of it when we were here in um, February because uh, they were still taking it down when we were here. But yeah, so I had to get a picture uh, in front of each one of these because I'm, you know, doing the four parks in one day challenge. So obviously I have to do that and then put them all in a little collage four parks in one day. thousand edible plant species in the world. Most of us are only familiar with the handful that make up our everyday diet. The common grains growing here, wheat, maize, sorghum, and millet, plus rice, account for nearly two-thirds of our global food consumption. Learning how to increase yields of these staples is an important goal of research around the world. Pomegranate? Mm -hmm, those are so good. That's oh, our favorite. That's good. <laughs> well, I would say it's definitely gotten a lot bigger since I was here in February. Innovative oh, so good. What are those? Bells. Oh, probably wouldn't be good. And pesticides. 
Another innovation at work here is our integrated pest management program. By populating our greenhouses with beneficial insects that prey on harmful...
waits for this to dry on the skin, then in about an hour it's going to flake away like mud. When it flakes away, it leaves a bright, bright orange stain. Then the orange stain darkens up by tomorrow. The longer you keep this on the skin, even as it's flaking, the better the stain will last by seven to ten days. Okay. Thank you. Is that it? Great, thanks. Wow. <laughs> Happy graduation. Right. <laughs> nice. That's awesome. That's what I said earlier. It looks like, like I want to take a picture. Hi, Animal Kingdom. Hi, Hi Animal Kingdom. <laughs> now we're off to Hollywood Studios. Yay! Hi. Yeah. I'm excited about Tower of Terror. Tower of Terror. Yes. Front row. Aerosmith. Yes. Woohoo! So we're off. Yes. <laughs> Let's do it. I'm hot. I'm sweaty. My butt crack is sweating. Everything else is sweating. I got boob sweat. Under boob sweat. Under boob sweat. Just but sweat. having fun. Oh yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't trade it for the world. Take boob sweat if it just <laughs> smells delicious. <laughs> It smells luscious. Or so one of them does. It smells luscious. Bye! Oh, you were yawning. Caught ya! <laughs> Caught ya yawning! As long as it's a happy yawn, it's good. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> <laughs> Look at these. By the end of the night, these guys are all like, Ugh. Let's get out of here now. Go yeah. on. Not until it looks like poop. I keep forgetting that. We were at there, but we didn't ride it. It'll be five, though. But we did buy this. That's so. true. That's true, you did. So now we have to do our picture. Holy stuff. Oh. There's a beast in there. Did he? <laughs> I think I did. That was stupid. That's hilarious. Oh well, I heard, yeah, I mean, it's running, so. I totally just walked into that garbage can. It's not the damn thing over. That would have been so funny. The guy in the blue shirt. Joe Bob up here. That's hilarious. Yeah, public stairs is. That was pretty hysterical. That's funny. This park looks a little thin out, thin out too. So this is where we first okay. met you guys. Oh, there's one right there. <laughs> Happy birthday. No, it doesn't count. You have to hear it. No, I was going to go up there and tell him. Too bad. Oh. <laughs> I was going to go got... tell him. All right, you little booger. Look at him. Four people. <laughs> I just got two and one. But I just got. She did. And I just said happy birthday. And she's like, happy birthday. <laughs> First visit. First visit. <laughs> Ew, ouch. Ew. Oh, yeah. 
and then boom! <laughs> yeah. What does your button say? Do you have a button? <gasps> Happy birthday! At Magic Kingdom. This is our last haul. We did it. We did the parks. <laughs> You're doing your hair again? No, I took it out. The rubber band broke. Magic Kingdom again. It has been a fun, fun, busy day. Fun, fun, fun. Oh, it's amazing. <laughs> the pretty garden you have there. There she is.
Antigua. 